So, well, good afternoon, you guys. Thank you for coming. Um, my name is Laura Weisgerber. Actually, I'm a counselor from the District of Chetwin, and I'm accompanied by Rochelle Galbraith, which is our other counselor from Chetwin, and Alan Calio, which is our economic development officer. Um, uh, first of all, I'm going to just give you guys a little bit of history about our competition in, in Chetwin. It started in 2005 with probably about five to six carvers that were mainly coming from BC and Canada. Since then, it has grown into one of the international chainsaw carving competitions that carvers uh, wait to get an invitation to. It, in order for them to come to our competition, they have to place first, second, and third in a major competition somewhere else. Some of the countries that we have that do come to it is the people from Japan, Lithuania, Ireland, Australia, the US, the UK, and of course right here in Canada. Um, we now have over 160 carvings in Chetwind, and we've given out 27 carvings to local communities, which has been really a highlight of our council career. Um, the carvings that are produced by these amazing, talented carvers leave us in awe and are extremely happy that we actually own that art. The three of us are excited and truly honored to be able to come, come here today to present this carving to you. Um, we hope you accept this carving as a thank you for the long and healthy relationship that we have had with McLeod Lake Indian Band. And we look forward to continuing our relationship to build a much nor stronger north. When we worked well together as neighbours, we on, not only create a strong economy, but we create a long and lasting friendship. So on that note, I would like to present this carving to you guys. It's um, carved by, as you guys see, John Rogers out of Prince George. Um, it was carved in 2006, and it's, um, I think it's pretty special, and I think it's found a great home. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Well, thank you very much. Um, on behalf of the Chief and Council for the Macaulay Canadian Band, I, I, I'm here to accept your great, um, your, your gift that you're giving us. Um, uh, I just wanted to say, you know, on as a part, as a counselor and as a mother and um, someone who's grown up in this area, I, I too believe in fostering relationships to make our North stronger, as you have said. And um, I just really appreciate the opportunity to to grow our relationship further and i can, honestly can't wait to see what the future holds for us so thank you very much yeah it's Thanks. great thank you thank you, thank you. Thank you. oh awesome so we have a gift for you guys and here that's wonderful we're presenting it that's wonderful we'll put that to good use in our council <laughs> mm -hmm. thank you very much thank you thank you Rochelle, did you have anything? Uh, no, I think you said it all. And, okay. and you're right, and Destiny, both on fostering and building relationships between our communities. Because I think it's important because we're small communities and we really do rely on each other mm -hmm. um, to build better working relationships. And I think we're doing just that. So thank yeah, you. Exactly. Absolutely. There's not very many we can lean on being isolated com um, communities. So it's the more relationships we can build and the better we can get them is right. always welcoming. So. Exactly. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. So, Thank you very much.